Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and today we're going to talk about the Cortana and especially for those new countries the default update will add Cortana. Now in the fall update we have Cortana that is added to Canada. Um, apparently also Japan and Japanese, India, I don't know in which language though, and Australia should have Cortana. Of course, there's going to be uh, more countries before the end of the year, but there's something you got to know. Before Cortana works, when you get this update, there are a few things that you need to set right. And for example, Cortana is now available here in Canada, and now you see my computer is set to Canada, and I have the little microphone. I can ask Cortana stuff. I just ask for the weather. But the thing is, the Cortana does not work right out of the box if you're in these countries. It will ask you to do things and it's not very clear. When you'll click for Cortana, first of all, you might need to s actually activate manually. So, uh, you know, type Cortana in your search box if you don't have it. Go into Cortana and search settings. Uh, here you'll set on for Cortana. And uh, when that happens, what's going to happen, you need to also uh, change a few things and download the language packs for your region. And that's something that's not clear because when Cortana is set at on, you will might notice that it's going to say, oh, you need to change your language settings or your voice settings or whatever to have Cortana working right. But it's not clear. They don't say anything. So what you want is that when it asks you to change the settings uh, in the region and language settings, what Cortana wants basically is in the speech category, make sure that the proper language that Cortana can support is selected. So here is English Canada. And another thing that you'll need to check to make sure that it works is in the region and language your languages are here but you see it says language pack installed you'll need to do so so you need to click your language you need to go to options and if a language pack is available download the language packs unfortunately that's not clear and that doesn't really you know they don't explain anything so if you are in a country where Cortana works, but it just doesn't work, make sure you're in the right country settings. Make sure that the language packs are installed. That's very important. If you have no language packs installed, Cortana cannot work. Once you've done that, once you've added the language you want, you've selected the country and region you want, you selected the correct speech language country and language. What you need to do is shut down your computer by going to power and shut down and restart. And normally after tweaking these settings, you'll see that Cortana now can listen to you. So if I ask, for example, what is the weather like? It's going to tell me. It just told me um, in my ears, probably you don't hear it, but that it's 10 degrees and raining, and it gave me the weather like I asked. And so Cortana is available in Canada. If you are in Canada, why not try her out? It's really, really cool. And any country that it's available to. If you're in a country that it's not available, uh, first of all, don't ask me when it's going to be available because we don't really know. But you can trick Cortana into working, even if you're in a country it doesn't work. All the, the only thing you need to do is simply set Cortana for uh, United States. Just put your computer in the United States. Say that your country is United States and so on, and that you're using uh, US, United States English. And for most people, this works. And you temporarily get Cortana, even though it's not in your preferred language. So this is a little tips and tricks video for the Cortana settings. Uh, if you don't have the Cortana working, 
after the fall update and you're in a country where it should uh, it's not auto automatic you have to actually go tweak these settings if you enjoy my videos why not subscribe to my channel you'll be informed when your videos are online you have comments questions problems anything you want to know let us know we'll try to help you if we can and uh, hope this update and everything's going well with you thank you for following us it's always a pleasure to have your feedback